So the Dante Stakes is next. Well, the Dante Stakes, depending on where you come from, I suppose. This is a prestigious derby trying to cause over 10 furlongs for three-year-old Cox, Mexican Cowboy, Leon Van Rensburg, Carignano, Michael Scala, Diligentis, Jim Murray, Marketeer, Paul Rhodes, Persian King, Dan Hughes, and non-applause Craig Allen. Only six of them to face the start of them in this derby trial. And... Oh, in and ready to go. And away they go. A little bit slow at market here, but that may well have been on purpose. And Mexican Campbell on the inside has taken it up. And he's going to be the early leader. And nothing seems all that bothered about challenging at this stage. And Jockey just taking a tour on Mexican Campbell. Doesn't want to go too far. Clear Persian King is in second. Then non applause is in third. With Greg Allen, who took the big trials yesterday. It'll be interesting to compare them today. Diligentis is a Jim Murray horse that's not in the lead, which is a bit of a surprise. And Marketeer out on the back in those new Paul Road silks. But it's Mexican Cowboy who's too clear in the Dante then with seven furlongs to go. From non applause in second and Caragnano third. Persian King Diligentis. In fact, they're virtually in a line, aren't they? With Musketeer or Marketeer just about the back marker by a couple of lengths. The same sort of distance as Mexican Cowboy leads by. So into the final six they go, then Mexican Cowboy clearing the lead from Persian King and Non Applause together, then a little bit of a gap of half a length to Carignano, then Diligentis and Marketeer is now beginning to pull round the outside. They've got five furlongs to race and they're beginning to sweep into the Long York Strait. And Mexican Cowboy leads by two and a half to Non Applause and then Persian King. Racing away from us now, then you can see the Long Strait and Mexican Cowboy passes the four pole with a lead of three. Looks to be going well within himself. Non Applause is trying to challenge in second. Carignano back in third. And now Mexican Cowboy, as soon as Non Applause get close, and Jockey says go and he's gone. And it's Mexican Cowboy's too clear to Non Applause in second. Carignano is beginning to make ground but slowly then comes Persian King Diligentis and Marketeer haven't picked up at all but it's Mexican Cowboy inside the final two still too clear of non applause in second Carignano is third then Persian King Marketeer and Diligentis with a lot of work to do they're inside the final furlong now then and it's Mexican Cowboy still too clear non applause is beginning to get a little bit closer it's between these but Mexican Cowboy looks the stronger the jockey's taking it pretty easy here comes non applause on one last lunge and non applause has got up to take it non applause is a Dante Mexican Cowboy second, Burson King third, Marketeer four, then Carignano and Diligentis. And once again, there will be controversy about the ride given by a jockey because it did not look as though Mexican Cowboys jockey was trying all that hard in the final quarter furlong or so. And non applause has taken it for Craig Allen to give him a bit of a headache or maybe a double hand for next week's derby as non applause takes it there's the local bookies on the phone now wanting to quote prices mexican cowboy has taken it into second for leon van rensburg persian king dan hughes third marketeer paul rhodes fourth carignano for michael scala was fifth